preservation. I would have to say we preserve a lot of the good old things. Uh, a lot of it hopefully finds a good home. We have a lot of good things in our house, but I would say probably the preservation of it. I think with antique dealers, there's so much camaraderie. And at the same time, there's always something new to see or something to learn about. So that's what intrigues us. We end up traveling around the U.S., different states, and we set up and take down antiques. I hunt a lot for sterling. I hate to see sterling melted down. A lot of people turn it in for the money and they melt it down, but a lot of pieces that we have in our booth, they can never, ever be replaced. So my philosophy is if we can buy it and sell it to someone else that has the same appreciation for it, because so much of this just can't be replaced. The little drummer boy, uh, the fact that he is motorized and he works is things that we look for because toy collectors will look for this sort of thing. They look to see what kind of condition a lot of it is in, and we try and find things that are really in pretty good condition. The cars, if they have original box, which a lot of Bob's personal collection, if he finds a good one that has the original box, anytime you can have an original box with it, it brings more money, worth more.